Hey guys, um, if you're seeing this video, that means that I am willing to trade um, some cards to get misprints. Um, that's really about the only thing that I'm willing to trade because it's something that I really want. Um, but don't don't think that I'm not going to do the trade um, and not require you to send a tracking and you know secure envelopes and all those type of things. I'm going to be spending a bunch of money shipping these cards to you. I expect the same back. Uh, these are both Altis. That might be sold for 15 cash. If you offer more, you know, I may do it. Um, Ultra to go Stardust. Alti Hero Lives. These are both Ultras. That's a Super Debris. Um, I value the vapors at 10 each because people in my area are just going crazy for these. So, sorry if you don't like it. Both the veilers are rare. This is a super judgment. Pretty hard to find. And the pots, I value at 10 because, like I said, people in my area uh, don't have them. They're just a bunch of high school kids and young kids that don't have any money. Uh, that's a gold dad. Those are both unlimited lances. Uh, two ultra IOCs and one gold. Um... Values on these can kind of play around a little bit. I can get 30 out of the gold and usually around 60 out of the ultras for trade at least, you know. Ultra Fortress Dragon, these are all supers uh, first except for this Tengu, it's unlimited. Um, these are very hard to find as far as I know, they're 20 each. Uh, these ultra rare tokens are pretty hard to, to come by in great condition, all those are mint. Um, well, this is an ulti. Chalice, and this is Ultra, Ultra Gores, Ultra Tuning, and Ulti Tuning. Of course, the first because Star Strike Blast is all first. The Raven is unlimited. Oh, these are both LOBs. That's a Super Fishborg. It's like 10 bucks if you still want it, you know. That's an Ulti first pull on the rug. Um, and Champion Pack Kong. These are Ultras. Ultra MRD. The, the original, not a, not a new MRD. Uh, Alti, Secret Secret from the Tens, Alti, um, Alti, Alti, and the new Worm. Um, Alti, Ultra, all those are Ultra Gold, gold Supers, uh, Highlander is only one rarity. That's an Alti Berserker, Ultra Loki, Violon Deltas, Hidden Arsenal First Editions. Tin Wyvern, uh, that's a rare Android, not a super. I don't have a label here. These are seven to eight dollars. Everything you see here is seven to eight. Uh, the Hobbly Gadgets, I have two there. That's a gold Sengen. That's a playset. I will only if you see a playset, that's the only way I'll get rid of it. That's a Super Cat, Super Dad. Those are all ultras, of course. These are ultras, of course. Everything, like I said, is seven to eight dollars each because that's what I can get for them at my local area. Um, these are both, it's an Alti, uh, Draco. Uh, Ultra First, Ultra Unlimited. I know they shouldn't be worth the same, that's why they're 7 to 8. <laughs> um, I think they're both first. It's an Ultra Power Bond. Card's getting a lot more play than used to. This is a Unlimited Safe Zone, these are first. That's an Alti Transmigration. That Maryland card's not for trade. Uh, nothing else in that binder. Okay, that's the first one down. The next one is cards that go in decks. I'm going to kind of fly through as quick as possible. If you need to know rarity, let me know. Um, it will be hard for me to break up anything in a deck. I mean, really, really, really hard. Like, I'm probably going to not even trade anything, except for the cerebrals. i got lots and lots of cerebrals. So I can trade those. Almost nothing else is for trading this uh, Fables. But, well, all these cards... Don't get a lot of play, so you, I'll trade anything on here, this page. But I'm trying to sell the Fable as a deck. Um, I can break all this. I like to try to sell the, get rid of the Rikos as a, uh, all three, but uh, two supers and a, and a gold. Um, but I can get rid of anything on that page. I can break anything, you know. I can easily break these up because they can't be as a set. But I really like to try to get recharges as a set. One recharge, this one I think is bent pretty bad. I think I have two Ultras, Super... I think that's a just a rare. No, it's a dual terminal. That's a dual terminal. I think I have two supers here, a gold gold, 
Uh, everything else you see, I think there's two heats there. There's three Miracle Fusions, two Ice Edge, two Ulti Skyscrapers. I think there's, I guess there's just one Super Poly. And I think there's three Heroes Blast, one has a bend. Uh, Dark World, that Ulti first. Uh, gold's worth quite a bit, it's over 20. These are all, there's three uh, rare Silvas there. Ulti Brawn, and then there's three Brows, maybe four, something like that. And the Super Dark World Dealings, I think there's three first. And like I said, that will be a playset. Uh, zombie stuff, I got lots of extra Zombie Masters. Everything you see here is a, a hollow. And all first, uh, I think there's this one's the only unlimited. And these are all Super Goblin Zombie promos. I think there's two gold plagues there. All the Book of Life's are first, except for this one. And once again, play sets. Uh, one of these Ultra Wonder Magicians is, uh, is spoken for already. So I need to get that out of there. There's three gladiators here. Maybe four. Um, everything here I can trade, you know, one by one. No big deal. There's no play sets on any of this. Uh, that is a dual terminal necromancer, by the way. Sorry for the bad lighting. I got every light in my living room turned on, and it still kind of sucks. Um, that's a gold gale, as you can hopefully see there. Oh, and uh, the, the Icaruses, there's a blue and a purple for the dual uh, dual league. And I'm only getting rid of the dragons altogether. That's a super white stone of legend, by the way. It's an ulti psychic overload, if I remember correctly. I think it is, yeah. And there's one of each rarity there. There's an ulta, ulti, a gold, and an ultra. Kind of strange. And these are made by me, so you know those are dollars. I really shouldn't have them in the uh, in here. The values on these guys just—it's real easy to figure out. Just go to eBay, look at the completed listings. If it's too low, I'll just keep the card. You know, if it's under five bucks. And now a lot of these hidden arsenals are like a dollar, so don't sweat it. Uh, we can always play around. Now that's an ulti Dark Soul. I know these are crap. They're just in there for the kids that don't have any money. Dragoonides, I'd like to try to do as a deck, but whatever. Uh, Jirax, you know, I'd like to try to do as a deck, but I can't do it until I get some of the Harrows. Um, worms, just whatever, don't care. I know I'm going kind of fast, and you're going to probably have to pause it. Sorry about that. Ice. I don't think anybody's going to want any of the ice beer. There's Miss Valley. I doubt anybody's going to want any of those. But I'm going to just show them really fast. Oh, that's a dual terminal ultra uh, windmill Gen X. So kind of hard to get. Kind of cool. Not really pricey. Yeah, I don't have any extra Birdmans in here. Actually, I do somewhere. I just need to find them. Uh, they might have been in the other binder, I just don't remember. Uh, this is the like the uh, cheap fables that I forgot to put in the other other part of the fables. Actually, he's he's getting some play. And then there's a whole, like a Gravekeeper's core. And these are actually Super Valleys. Uh, that's a first edition Necro Valley. And, uh, and a first edition Tribute. Two steals. And then there's these I can always throw into a trade. I value them at five each. Okay guys, last binder, this is all really cheap stuff. This is, as you can see, five bucks um, for everything, and then it goes down four, two, one, you know, three, two, one, so forth. Everything you see here is five bucks. If you have any questions on rarities, let me know. I'm gonna fly through here. There's two captains there. I think there's three granules, maybe just one, or I mean, maybe just two. There's two Valkyrie. There's the Birdman's, I knew they were somewhere. <laughs> Uh, those are Alti, Supreme Arcanite, and Neos Knight. Uh, these are the tins. Uh, there's two tamings there. There's two Starlight Roads, two Epidemic, maybe three. Um, two GDVs. There's three of everything here, obviously. One, two, three. Um, these are all four dollars. There's three Zerados. I think there's maybe two Power Giants. I can't really remember. Uh, there's two Neos Knight, two or three Gaia, two Supreme Arcanite, something like that. So, uh, two Regeki Bottle, two Roaring Earth. These are all three dollars. 
this is just like these are going to get pretty hot with the Gemini plus the fact that you can bring out Nova Master uh, as a good fire, a little bit better than uh, heat, but that's debatable, of course. Those are all T bubble mains. and I think I have like five or six of these. Yeah, let's see, there's five total. So, oh, that's a that's actually the ultra rare, not the secret. I don't know if that matters to any of you. Oh, that's an ulti bicorn, ulti first. Dark Strike, if anybody still plays type 1. Another great type 1 card, one of the greatest ever. I think there's two Sarks there, maybe just one. Ulti Dimension Wall, still love that card. Interdimensional Matters, you know, first edition Ultra, pretty hot with a zero. Rikiki Bottle, I think there's two there. And these are $2 cards. Mara, Ulti Water Dragon, uh, Gold, Ultra, Ultra. Oh, geez. I think I had Vendagion. Yeah, I had Vendagion over there on the $3. So, I guess he's $2. <laughs> I'll move him real fast while I'm doing this. I'll shove him right there, so... There's two Vendagions. <laughs> Weird. Oh, these are the ten. That's ten. That's a uh, Master Collection. Ten. And those are Ultras. The uh, Immortals. Or Earthbound Immortals, I should say. Tons of Barbarosas for two bucks. Tragic Queen for a Glad or a Crystal Beast. Uh, one of these Guardians, I think this one's pretty messed up um so i could do that one for a dollar you know whatever it is they are supers obviously i wouldn't put commons in here for and there are commons that are worth a dollar or two but i don't put them in here yep tens and masters for ten two bucks until somebody breaks that wind up deck that's what they're going to be worth to me these are the ultra veils if anybody wants them uh that's an unlimited the others were first that's why they were like a dollar more one dollar. This video is getting really long, so I'm just going to kind of fly through as quickly as possible. Hopefully, the lighting hasn't reduced the quality so bad that you can't see them. These are all alties. Everything you see here is an alti. Gaia Soul. Uh, I still play this in Playbills. Actually, works pretty well with uh, with Dog. You, know, you want to bring out a uh, two non-tuners instead of uh, you know, Magician. People are like, "Why would you do that?" Well. <laughs> exceeds or you already have a tuner on the field or you have tuners in the grave and you're about to play rekindling some of these have dual uh, you know doubles underneath I try not to ever do that because it stretches out the binder but sometimes you just got to do it because you don't have room uh, that's a dual terminal necro shade or I think that's his name yeah necro shade Please, somebody take these dragon newts off my hand <laughs> at a dollar each. I would love to get them out of my binder. One of my favorite cards ever. Love that card. It's like a an easier version of Spell Striker. You just drop them on the field whenever you feel like it. You don't have to, your opponent doesn't have to have any monsters or whatever. There's no, you just special summon them. You just can't have more than one on the field. Um, this, all these, this, this nine, I'm only getting rid of all together. Just thought I'd kind of put you put that out there. These are both ulti. It's a really good looking ulti in person. Yeah, no zero max. It's not that great, but if you don't have like you know some of the other Infernity cars, uh, you can still play it. Uh, those are both ultis. Ulti, ulti. You know what are they called? Uh, Mirror gate for the e heroes. That's an ultra security orb. I think that's the only way it came. Well, I guess it came as ulti, but whatever. D2 shield, not a horrible card. Just kidding. And that's it, guys. Thanks for watching.